Hello YouTube, this is my strengths and weaknesses. I'm, my name is Matthew. I've never made a video before on YouTube, so this is going to be kind of interesting. Uh, I wanted to start doing this. I wanted to start doing a vlog, a blog, whatever whatever they call it. Um, I've been watching quite a few of these. I watch a lot of people talk about weight loss, um, diets, and different things. So I wanted to kind of take you along for my journey. Um, I am a truck driver. I work, I work in the oil field. I've been doing oil, oil field water hauling for 10 years. And I love it, but I went over the road for 18 months. Uh, during that time period, I gained a, a lot of weight. I got up to 320 pounds. Uh, I was having all kinds of problems. I mean, I couldn't walk very far, you know, a foot would swell up or something. Um, I would have heart palpita palpitations, where your heart starts to flutter. You start losing energy. You think you're going to die. I mean, I had all kinds of problems. And after 18 months, my wife finally asked me to take a local job. Asked me, you know, come home. And so I did. I went back into the oil field. Came off the truck at 320 pounds, and it sucked. I mean, I couldn't couldn't hardly walk. I mean, the the first two weeks were hor were absolutely horrible. My legs, my calves, my ankles were so sore that I couldn't bend my knees. Um, but I. So I, I knew that I needed to make a change. I got back, I got, I got back into the oil field. You know, it's gonna try to get back into some shape. Didn't happen. Kept making excuses, excuses, excuses. And then one day I ran across um, a video about keto. Kind of interesting. Um, ran ran across. Um, some YouTube pages talking talking about different things, how insulin works and this and that. And I started getting, you know, I started watching video after video after video. Uh, I've watched what seems like thousands of hours of YouTube over, over the last few years. So I decided to try it. I mean, I needed to make a change. I really needed to make a change. Um... Uh, I kept making excuses. I kept kept pushing back on, you know, I'll go get a gym or, gym membership on my, on my next paycheck. You know, just over and over, things of that sort. And finally I stopped. I still smoke though. But I I got tired of it all. I I went and, went and got a gym membership. Decided I was going to I was going to try this keto diet. You know, give up sugar, carbs, junk food, and stuff. I mean, I've done the Atkins diet before, mostly as a cleansing, but never, never anything more, more than that. So, at 320 pounds, I went to Planet Fitness of all places. It was close by. It was cheap, and I started working out. I would listen to motivational speeches. I mean, from The Rock, even from Arnold Schwarzenegger, and and other other famous people people I didn't even know and that's what helped motivate me I made it into a habit I went I go three to five days a week go work out for an hour hour and a half and I remember the first time I walked in you know I was thinking I'm gonna I'm gonna walk for 20 30 minutes I'm gonna go hit the stair stepper for 15 minutes and I'm gonna go hit some weights yeah stairs the stair stepper absolutely kicked my ass I mean, I was a minute and a half, and I was I was less than a minute and a half on the thing, and I was done. I couldn't do it. I mean, but over time, over a time period of about three months, I kept at it. I kept taking, I kept going further and further, getting stronger and stronger. And I wasn't even truly on a diet at the time. I was messing around with the keto diet. I was playing around with stuff, playing around with recipes. I wanted to kind of see how, how it would work. I mean, I knew that cutting out the sugar and the carbs would allow me to drop some weight pretty quick. You know, but you, 
everyone says on I didn't want to I didn't want to quit doing everything cold turkey so for five days a week through my work schedule I while I was at work I would do the keto diet and then when I would be off for two days I would eat normal I'd go out and eat I'd eat whatever I wanted to but I worked out I kept at it and just from stop eating at McDonald's I dropped 10 pounds and then I you know you drop the water weight you drop another 10 or 15 pounds of water weight and you build muscle you step on the scale and you're like you don't see much of a change and I knew that that was going to happen I understand and I absolutely understood that that's why I didn't go on the diet full-time at the time because I was trying to build muscle um, and I knew that if I lost 10 pounds in fat and I gained 10 pounds in muscle I wouldn't see a change for quite a while but that's what I did and at the beginning of the year right on the first I went on the diet full-time I've dropped from 320 pounds and I'm currently between 270 and 275 and I'm in great shape I, I mean I feel great I was under 40 46 jeans I'm back down to a 42. I can't even wear the 46s anymore. Um, I, I feel great. I'm still in the process of trying to lose weight. I, I'm not doing the best at it at the moment, but that's why I wanted to start making these videos. I wanted to start doing this. I wanted, you know, I had started the first leg of this whole thing, and I wanted to kind of, I, I decided I wanted to take, you know, I've been watching a lot of videos of this type. A lot of people, a lot of inspiration, and I decided I want to explain my story. I want to tell the world my story. I mean, maybe I can get get good get get advice or help someone else out. I mean, it's not easy. It it, it takes an unbelievable amount of, of dedication to be able to do this. An unbelievable amount. I mean, I've driven my wife and my and my friends nuts I mean watching all the videos about everything I get my hands on about how keto works why it works um, how sugar affects you how salt affects you um, di diabetes how it affects your body how to you know cure it whatever I've watched just hundreds of videos doctors and everybody I'm, I mean I'll name people later on when I've actually figured out how to attack people because I'm still learning on how to use this thing uh, like I said, I've never been on YouTube before. I have watched a lot of YouTube, but I've never been on it before. But I wanted to let other people see the struggles, you know, the strengths of the, the strength that it takes to understand your own weaknesses. And I want, I, I just, this is not as easy as, this is not as easy as it looks. And it's not as easy as it sounds. It's hard to make a video. This is like my fourth try. I'm just running with it. I'm not scripted. Uh, I'm probably I'm off my phone. I don't have a camera. All, all these videos are probably going to be off my phone. I will try to do the best I can. Um, they're going to be in random places, especially when I'm at work and I get an idea and I want to talk about something. Um, I want to be able to explain, you know, my life's experiences, the things that I've been through, the hardships that I've that I've been under and that, that you know of being a big guy I've always been a big guy I, there's a lot of guys a lot of people that are bigger than me and I completely understand that my best friend is 300 pounds and he makes every excuse in the world not to diet not to work out not to get that motivation and I'm trying to lead by example I mean I just figured if I show him that I can do it maybe he can too and that is really why I'm doing this, why I'm trying to make these videos and trying to get trying to get something started is if I can inspire anyone, I mean, that would be the greatest thing in the world. So stick around. I'm gonna try to make this work as much as possible. And I hope that you enjoy. Thank you.